My name is Kat and my book is called The Essential Guide to Surfing. I've loved writing ever since I knew how. I learned to surf in West Wales when I was 16 and I've surfed around the world but I always love to come back home. I started my career here at Abbey Uni and developed writing and IT skills in information services. I always wanted to write for a living so I moved to Cornwall to work for a surfing magazine publisher. I worked very hard there for five years writing about anything and everything to do with surfing. I began to do some freelance writing and saw a call for authors from Lifestyle Guide Publishers Need to Know. I was attracted to the simple, clear style of the series, the creative challenge and the fact that it would look good in my portfolio. Once my pro proposal was accepted, I began my research. I went surfing a lot. I also looked at similar guides and thought about what they did well and what could be improved. But mostly it was just my own knowledge of and passion for surfing and the fact that I can still clearly remember how hard it is to be a beginner surfer. I'm still a kook after nearly 19 years. Surfing is a really hard sport to learn, but it makes you happy whether you're a beginner or a pro ripper. I wanted to share my joy of being in the ocean with others. I loved writing the book, but it wasn't without its problems. My advice to other writers would be to check the small printer contracts and make sure your editor is someone you trust and respect. It makes things so much easier. Check the proofs very carefully. There is still a typo on my book's back cover and stand your ground when it really matters so you can be proud of the end product. I've come full circle and I'm back at Abbey Uni doing a PhD in creative writing, writing a novel about a surfing tribe in rural Wales. The two things that most define my life, my love of the ocean and my desire to write, have become my work as well as my play. It's all lining up for me. Thanks to Need to Know, everyone involved in the Abbey Book Festival, my parents and all the Cranor boys.